So there's a problem on your podcast. Now, if you're doing a podcast and then suddenly there is a sound coming from the outside, say for example, an ambulance, even if you're in the comfort of your home doing your podcast, when things happen like a passing ambulance is passing on your street, the sound of the ambulance is really uh, very high and it could penetrate through your studio or through your wall. So I've been editing podcasts for uh, three years and I encountered a lot of instances like that. So here's my tip for you guys that you can remove the sound of the ambulance from your podcast. So let's begin. So tell us a little bit about yourself and how did you become an entrepreneur? Like I am right now. You know, we continue to do things that can be expanded. And although we may have to change some of those things, the online element of what we're doing is going really well. So having said that, I've owned personalized product companies, owned a magazine company, and we have since started an augmented reality company, a technology company we're very excited about. So tell us a little bit about yourself and how did you become an entrepreneur? Like I am right now. You know, we continue to do things that can be expanded and although we... There are a lot of software out there, but my favorite for uh, this specific task is a software from Isotope. It's called RX7. So just yesterday, I encountered this... uh, ambulance sound again so i decided to create a video so you guys can do it yourself so let's put this file to the center real quick take a listen to this so isotope has many tools that you can use everything around here are for the audio so you can edit everything that you want to your audio so right now let's focus on the tools that we're going to use to remove the sound of the ambulance so tell us a little bit about yourself and how did you become an entrepreneur like i am right now you know we continue to do things that can be expanded and although we may have to change some of those things the online element of what we're doing is going really well. So having said that, I've owned personalized product companies, owned a magazine company, and we have since started an augmented reality company, a technology company. Yeah, that ambulance sound is really annoying. Now let's take a closer look on the waveform of that ambulance sound by going here click and drag that slider from left slowly going to right the window will change from waveform to spectrogram the waveform is blue and spectrogram slide is colored orange and why are we doing this because in the waveform we cannot see the the visual activity of the ambulance sound while in a spectrogram you can clearly see what's going on now you see this little wavy line here that is probably the sound of the ambulance that is written to the spectrogram so what we're gonna do is move your mouse to the brush selection tool right here and click on that one next is click and drag the beginning of the sound of the ambulance follow the waveform by dragging it like that towards the end now after you drag it should be highlighted now it's time for you to delete the sound 
by pressing delete button. Now let's play it again. So, and how did you become an entrepreneur? Like I am right now. You know, we continue to do things that can be expanded. And although we may have to change some of those things, the online element of what we're doing is going really well. So having said that, I've owned personalized product companies, I own a magazine company, and we have since started a augmented reality company, a technology company we're very excited about. So, Yeah, it sounds like the majority of the ambulance sound is clearly deleted. But there is some residue uh, in the waveform that needs to go also. So that's the next thing that we're going to deal with. So let's slide back the spectrogram to the waveform. Zoom in a bit. On this part right here, you can still see that there is some activity going on that also needs to go so there's one more thing that needs to do navigate to your effect modules click the spectral denoise make sure you highlight the in between word part where there is silence over the top click learn button Rx is trying to learn or analyze the waveform that you are highlighted. Click render. Now that part is clean up. Do that to another area. Once again, click render. Now it's time to do it to the whole thing. Go to edit menu and select all or simply control a on your keyboard then click render once again let's play it again personalized product companies own a magazine company and we have since started a augmented reality company a technology company we're very excited about so tell us a little bit about yourself and now your podcast is clean and it's ready for production. So that's it, guys. I hope you like this video. Share this with your friends and to your colleagues. Of course, you don't need a audio engineer to do your stuff. There is a software that can actually do it just like this. Now you can go ahead and export your work by going to the file menu. Click export and then choose mp3 or whatever file system that you are working on. It's up to you. Now the file is safe. Let's listen to it again. So tell us a little bit about yourself and how did you become an entrepreneur? Like I am right now, you know, we continue to do things that can be expanded. And although we may have to change some of those things, the online element of what we're doing is going really well. So having said that, I've owned personalized product companies, I own a magazine company, and we have since started a augmented reality company, a technology company we're very excited about. Now your podcast is clean and it's ready for production so that's it guys i hope you like this video so i'll see you again in my next video bye for now